next up we have James. Okay. James, how you doing? Good, good. Oh, oh there's like two James. Out. Yeah. <laughs> just talk. There's like three James out there. I don't know if you're talking to me, but yeah, I can oh, see you. I love the energy. All right. So um, basically, I run Make Knicks Great Again on Instagram, and my question is. Playing in New York City, especially the Knicks, is like playing underneath a microphone glass. What I mean by that is uh, if you play well, you know how we treated players like Jeremy Lin or Przingis. But if you play bad, you know how we treated some of your teammates this year. So uh, <laughs> does that, like, motivate you or does that, like, pressure you? And how does that work for you? <laughs> oh, <for me? laughs> That's a good one. That's a good ass question. <laughs> Yeah, I think I, don't know. About I think that. I try to play good regardless. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to play good regardless. <laughs> Definitely for the Knicks fans, I'm trying to make y'all proud. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to make y'all proud. And uh, I don't know. That's really all I got. If I play bad, I play bad. But most of the time, uh, I'm thinking I'm going to play good. And, you know, hopefully I put it on a show for y'all. All right. Good answer. I, I, I see your face Dang now. Yeah. I see your face now. So, so just I'm going to remember that. <laughs> <laughs> James, is there a reason why you guys are so hard on the New York Knicks players throughout the years? I mean, I'm a Laker guy, but I mean, you guys oh, really no. go hard. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're used to success. We're not seven years of no playoffs. <laughs> Makes sense, right? <laughs> you guys got the prodigy over here, man. So I'm sure that'll I be up to change. I just got here. Oh, man. <laughs> 